Three, two, one. <laughs> Well, there's a will, there's a way, kind of beautiful And every night has a state so magical And if there's love in this life, there's no obstacle That can't be defeated For every tyrant to tee up all the vulnerable Alright, hey guys, this is going to be System Test 8 Um, Sorry, I didn't put up some a lot of new alarms Some of them came broken and some of them like are not big enough the screw is not big enough for them but soon next system test i will definitely get some new alarms that's gonna fit and yeah so like as you can see like i was gonna put up my mask but the screw is not big enough like it won't fit through like i'll show you you can you guys can see that right the screw is not big enough for the, my for my mass, but when I get a bigger screw, I will definitely use my mass. And I was also gonna put up my um, E90, but uh, the strobe is working, but the chime is broken. Uh, so yeah, which I was very disappointed about. But uh, I'll get another one. Once, if the chime is fixed, I'll definitely try to hook it up. And plus, it's a little too heavy for these little flat walls. And I'll probably have to, like, install it on wood or something as long as it's not uh, too loose. And, yeah. Uh, but anyways, um, let's get started with the alarms. So, right here we have a Notifier VG10. And here we have a Siemens U MMT set on single stroke only um someone took off the dip switches to switch it so like the strobe will go but the horn will just like go off a couple times and that's it so um yeah and right here in zone two we have my simplex t-bar up here and my wheel lock mt and like so what i was saying like i wanted to put my mass up there but like i said the screw is too small to put i'll need a longer screw but maybe when i get a longer screw i promise i'll put my mass up there and yeah so um like down over here we've got my wheel lock exceeder Set on 185 Candela. And the horn does sound very scratchy. I don't know why. Like, the strobe works fine, but it's just a horn. And, yeah. And now... I think we should just get started. So, let me go ahead and put this in. And yeah, let's get started. Three, two, one. Yeah, you see, it's only the strobe that's gonna go off right now. Let me do my um MT. It's gonna sound really cool, guys. Come on, what? All right, there we go. Here we go. Three, two, one. It's set on bell. Now let me go ahead and do my exceeder.
You hear the horns? Well, it sounds perfect. It sounds scratchy to me. There it goes. You hear it now? Listen. The horn does sound scratchy. I don't know why. And you set it. Listen to the horn. There goes the horn on my UMT. Let's set my um, P bar. There's my horn on my exceeder. It does sound very scratchy. It's annoying how it sounds very scratchy. Now let's um, start to do, I might um, do one, one alarm at one time now. So here it goes. Three, two, one. The strobe here on my MT is set on 15 Candela, I think. Yeah. So, yeah. Now, let's set it. I'm going to do my horn. Listen to the horn. Hear it? It's, it's single stroke. That's why it does that. And I mean, now let's go to my wheel lock empty. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna key activate it this time. take out these wires if you, if you test your alarms with nine volt batteries make sure you take the wires off because i heard that could set your house on fire so yeah you always want to take these off because that can set your house on fire because it will over the batteries will start to overheat from touching the wires and then, like, if it gets too hot, it could start a fire. And yeah. Let's do my exceeder now. Well, I'll say that this is going to be the end of the video. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.